the motivational science stuff that, that I study validates what you're saying to the degree that what's crucial is that what you're describing as your parents doing is giving you explicit agency over making decisions. But uh, putting that in the context of a warm belonging, you know, like you're part of our, our family, we're supportive, um, and so being very explicit about that. And the way you've portrayed your husband's family is that they assumed that, that the system works and didn't necessarily emphasize sufficient agency. And so when he goes off to university, he didn't necessarily have a clear sense that he, he derives what he gets from that experience. So he went mm. along with the experience that was provided. And I did a similar thing. You know, I think a lot of people do. I think it's one of the oh, most yeah, yeah. dangerous it's things about natural. university. And for me, when I kind of went off to college right out of high school, I also left college in three years because in a different part of my life, after I graduated, I went to work at a summer camp uh, for each of the three years before going off to the college. And I discovered that there was a different reality that existed in the world where I could be purposeful and fulfilled and engaged and, and really feel like I'm contributing something valuable. And doing that, and then I go off to college, and I'm purposeless and, and anxious and depressed and didn't find particularly fulfilling or, or interesting or, you know, I did it. I had developed skills in, you know, making school work for me, uh, but they weren't as good because this was an elite institution, and I was like, you know, it wasn't quite getting by quite as well anymore. But the motivation for doing it was deficient. And that's what I was trained into through 12 years in, a, in just regular mainstream type schools was that motivation really doesn't matter. You know, you just do the work. Mm. And so having a deficient motivation and then being exposed to this other context where something was different and I realized, oh, that's what I want in my life. And so mm. I, left, I left the college. Uh, I became a certified professional nanny. That was a shift in going from something that was self-determined from something that was essentially mm -hmm. other determined. Yes, yeah. technically I made the choice to go to college and I chose the classes, mm -hmm. but it was, a, it was like being on the rails. It was like, yes, that was just the next thing. Mm -hmm. I was continuing the pattern. This is the Agentic Schools Podcast, where you will learn about schools from around the world where children's agency to make decisions about their learning and living is more important than their academic skills. I'm your host, Don Berg.